Hi, my name is Attorney Walter Rudolph Not the Third, and I'm with Disability Resolution PA, an Orlando-based law firm. Let's go ahead and do a disability tutorial video. All right, here we go. What do you need to know? I got a weird question yesterday, which, which is probably a pretty good question. Why is an administrative law judge, an ALJ, called an administrative law judge as opposed to being called just an A or just a judge? So why do we have an AL? J instead of just a J, administrative law judge versus judge. Well, I thought about that and I thought that is an interesting question because the answer is not really that simple. Give me the macro overview of when a court system comes into existence. You got to go all the way back to the first Supreme Court, which wasn't even called the Supreme Court. And as time goes on and time goes on, we added more space and territory to the United States, and so we needed more courts. We didn't just need the one court, we needed more courts. So what happened was we got more courts and more federal courts, and then you know we needed more little, you know, smaller courts rather throughout the country to cover all the geographic areas so that people could have their adjudication, their their day in court. And what happened was that Basically, over time, certain court systems like, you know, traffic court, family court, SSA, disability court, stuff like that, there were so many claims that they had to kind of create a sort of administrative law system. There was so much adjudication in these particular areas that they actually had to create a niche law docket, a niche court docket system where basically people go through these administrative functions in filing a claim. Otherwise, for Social Security disability, you would just file directly in federal court against the Social Security Administration requesting disability benefits. Then upon denial, you go you know, straight to federal court and then appellate court and then the Supreme Court. Well, in this particular case, you have something that's different. You have the Social Security Administration's uh, you know, docket system for disability, which is initial filing, reconsideration, ALJ, appeals council. Beyond that, you go into a federal appellate court because you've already had your trial at the ALJ stage. Okay. So then there was a uh, kind of an interesting question. Why do we call them ALJs and not just Js? Administrative law judges and not just judges. So um, that's what's going on. But um, you have an absolutely wonderful day. I'll catch you a little bit later. My name is Attorney Walter Ruth, not the third. I'm with Disability Resolution. Um, if you have any question for your unique claim, give me a call. Remember, by the time you watch this information, this video, this tutorial, uh, if you have any question for your unique claim, that's awesome. But remember, by the end of the day, by the time you watch this, the information's probably old hat. And you're probably going to need to give me a call anyways to go ahead and get the most update uh, reasoning and information. All right. I'll catch you a little bit later. Attorney Walter Nott, and thanks so much. Bye-bye.